Exports matter. Trade, we earn a living in Kansas by what we sell around the globe. And we certainly, a lot of focus, rightfully so, on agriculture, on farmers and ranchers, and Kansas is clearly an ag state. Uh, we bear the brunt in uh, the tariff retaliation uh, from China and other places. Uh, so when we get in a tariff war, it is Kansas agriculture, our farmers, ranchers, and the communities in which they live that suffer the most significant consequences. It's not just an agricultural issue. We are a state that uh, manufactures automobiles and significant manufacturing of aerospace and uh, airplanes. Uh, and aluminum and steel are important components as well as the supply chain. Mm -hmm. So we get retaliated on in agriculture, particularly with tariffs. And in both the case of agriculture and manufacturing, we are a beneficiary of NAFTA. Uh, and our trading relationship with, uh, with Mexico and Canada are important. In fact, Me Mexico is the number one uh, purchaser of agriculture commodities from Kansas. Uh, Canada is number two or three, depending upon the year. Senator, let's talk about uh, the announcement yesterday between President Trump and the EU, uh, just this idea that we are going to be sitting down and talking. We spoke with uh, Treasury Secretary Mnuchin earlier this hour, and he said that he has great hopes that the situation with the EU will clear up very quickly. He also said that he expects NAFTA um, to really get some resolution, he hopes, in the near future, too. Is that enough to make you feel better about things uh, when I know China is still a big, big part of the equation for you? Well, I would say that uh, clearing up NAFTA, for example, in the near future, clearing up Europe in the near future, I don't know exactly what that means, but if that's true, if there is something that is resolved in both those instances rapidly, immediately, that is awfully good news, and it's, it's helpful in regard to, to our concerns with China. Uh, one of the messages that I and other members of the Senate to, delivered to, to the White House was we understand the challenges we face with China, their stealing of our uh, trade secrets, intellectual property, the cyber attacks. Uh, Mr. President, it would be useful if we could narrow the scope and focus on China, and to do that, we need to have a good relation, a trading relationship with Mexico, Canada, the European Union. Let's single out our efforts worldwide. They share our concerns with what China is doing. Let's work together. So any resolution of uh, other issues can allow us to better focus on the problems that uh, China creates and their misbehavior, their violation of rules and, and, and the order of trade. I also would say that now is the time from an agriculture point of view, the circumstances we face, farmers and ranchers face in Kansas is, is significantly uh, challenging. It's dire, I would say. Commodity prices are at a, at a significant low. Uh, farm income is down significantly over the last uh, five years. Uh, and we need some reassurance, particularly as farmers go to their bankers and try to borrow money going into the new season. Fall crop planting is around the corner. Mm -hmm. If we knew that NAFTA was, uh, was satisfied, if we knew that we we're going to continue to have European markets, uh, that would be useful to give us some hope and to provide some certainty for those producers and their lenders. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.